Hey guys, Demon here, and today I'm going to do a really quick review of Frozen 2. Um, I'm going to do a really quick spoiler free, then spoilers. Okay, so really quick spoiler free. This was a very average Disney princess movie, to be honest. It was very cookie cutter. Um, nothing really new to be put there. And it was almost a musical, by the way. Just telling you, if you're wondering. It was pretty much a musical. There was like so many songs. Uh, and none of them were particularly good, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, like, very average, very cookie cutter. And uh, I don't think most people will like it. But I did bring my niece and nephew there. Uh, my niece is like 13 or so. So a young teenager and uh my my nephew is about 8. So a child, so a young teenager and a, and a younger child. I brought them there with me. And uh they said that they enjoyed it a lot. So and they've also watched Frozen 1 as well. So kids will like them. I guess technically one of the teenagers, so maybe like uh younger teenagers will like it as well. <laughs> Um, but maybe you'll like it too. I'm not sure. But it was just kind of average cookie cutter. Just cookie cutter Disney movie. Um, now spoiler section. Just in case you want to skip this part, you know, because you haven't watched it yet. So basically it starts off with Anna hearing voices. Um, she goes after these voices on an adventure to save Arendelle. And then uh, Hans is trying to propose to to Elsa. No, wait, so not Anna, sorry. Elsa hearing voices. She goes after these voices. Uh, Kristoff is trying to oppose, propose to Anna, propose to Anna. But he can't find the right moment. And Anna thinks that he's being a little bit weird and maybe he wants to break up with her. It's a little stupid plot line. And then he doesn't really get much screen time, to be honest. He gets, like, one song, and then he's, like, out of the whole movie. And then it focuses on Anna and uh, Anna and Elsa pretty much the whole time. There's some fake deaths there. There's some fake-out deaths. But then, of course, they come back to life because, you know, Disney logic. Uh, and at the end, Olaf's able to propose to Anna. Anna actually becomes the queen because Elsa wants to stay with the forest in the enchanted forest because she's a a spirit a spirit sort of thing sort of weird um so yeah in the end it has a happy ending and Elsa finally found her calling even though last even though the last one she found her calling but they made up some uh some kind of like Basically, they just made up a story to make her have a different calling, even though it's just kind of stupid, you know? It's basically just like, oh yeah, like, this is the end, but actually, this is her true calling, not this. <laughs> kind of just stupid, it's just like, really? Really? That's dumb. <laughs> um. So yeah, like, this was just a nonsense thing that didn't have to be there. And I could have thought of, like, so many ways this could be better. And, like, none of the songs really hit or anything like that. They were all very average. Uh, just very average songs. Uh, but, yeah. Like, I could have thought of better ways to make this thing. Like, there's so much questions that I wanted answers to, but we never got answers to. Like, I wanted more Kristoff in there. Um, like, I wanted to see what happened to Kristoff's parents. That'd be pretty cool to know. Kristoff got raised by trolls. Why? Where's his parents? Uh, why those ice people just pretty much abandoned a the child there? Uh, that would've been cool to see in a sequel. Um, it would've been cool to see, like, more magical people, too. That would've, that would've been cool if there was, like, a different magical person as an antagonist. And maybe even Anna found magic in herself or something like that. That would be cool. Like, there are just so many better ways to have this go, but it never happened. It was just kind of like, seriously? Meh. Like, meh. <laughs> 
go watch this if you really like Frozen. And if you have, like, kids, uh, younger kids, they'll probably love, they'll probably like it a lot. They might, like, love it, but they'll probably like it a lot. Um, but yeah, that's, that's my review of it. It's average. Uh, but that's my review. I hope you liked it. If you did, uh, check out the link down below to my Twitter. Also, a bell notification. Hit that, please. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. And as always, my friends, stay sane. Peace. If you did, you should check out this one or this one. Or, you know, click right there because that was subscribed to my channel. That middle one right there. Anyways, um, I hope you liked it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, and share. Go to my Twitter and follow. And as always, my friends, stay sane. Peace.